Hello everyone, welcome to the video tutorial of Access Press Store program. I'm gonna show you how you can configure your header with this theme. Well, in this video, I'm showing you how you can configure this sticker section, this header call to box section, and how you can upload your fab icon, your header logo, your header text, and how you can choose your header type or header layout. So let's get started by logging into your WordPress. Now go to appearance and then click on customize. Well from here you can customize your theme and now you need to go to general setting. First uh, configuration that we are going to do is ticker setting so let's go there. Make sure you enable this uh, ticker and then you can also change its ticker title. Here is the default field where you need to put your text you can put a link also then you can add a new field let me add one more field then the next one after that you need to click on save and publish now after you've saved it let's go back now click on site identity from here you can choose your site title and your tagline like the wording that you can see here is appearing because of this so you can change it from here but just keep it like that now you can also put a site icon which is basically a browser or an app icon it is also known as a fab icon that you can see in each tab to identify the site we are looking at so the maximum size that we can put in this uh, for site icon is image with 512 uh, pixel so let's select a file well I have it in my media library but uh, you can always upload a file from here so let me choose a file after I have chosen it I'm gonna save and publish after this you can also put a logo on your website's header so which you can do from this header image option here you need to click it the max and the best image size is 300 by 70 pixel so let's add a new image there I'm gonna add this image I'm gonna skip cropping but you can crop your image same thing I'm gonna save and publish this too now after this you can also upload a fab icon from here but uh, if you're gonna upload a fab icon from here then the image size should be 40 by 40 pixel but which we have already done from here so this is gonna be our fab icon for now after this the next thing that I'm gonna show you is how you can change your header type that is the way your menu appears on your header right now it's header 2 layout but you can choose header 1 and let, let us see how that will appear in our website so your website will appear in this form when you choose header 1 that is with all the menus that you have in your header menu then you have to save and publish and the final thing that I'm going to show you how to do is let me show you in the demo site that is this header to header call to box section which you need to configure from widget area so we need to go back to our dashboard we need to click on appearance and then click on widget now these are the widgets and these are all the widget area now this is the header call to box widget area where you need to put header call box widget here you simply need to put your phone number and your email address then click on save now let's close it now after we have done all the configuration let's go to our front end and see how will that appear in our front page 
now that you can see here is the ticker text with the link here is header call to box section then here is your uh, header text or site identity text with logo along with fab icon or a site icon so in this way these are the things that you can do in your header so I hope this video is helpful to you in configuring some of the sections on your header and if you have any confusion always refer to our online documentation where you will find a stepwise procedure of how to do it or you can write to me down below and I'll reply to you as soon as possible. Thank you very much.